Andres' daughter told me a lot about her dad, and it's clear the Low Country has lost a true public servant. He's always been a public servant. That's his favorite thing is, is people. Paige Schwann says her dad took his public service and helping people very seriously. He started out with being a reserve in the U.S. Navy. Um, he also did, he became a fire chief for St. Stephen's Fire Department before they were absorbed into Berkeley County. Once they got absorbed into Berkeley County, he went into EMS. Um, he did that for over 30 years. He became a supervisor to a lot of people that probably would have called him dad too because he did the, he always did the dad huff when he did something what you weren't supposed to. So, and then he'd fix it. He retired from the EMS after 30 years. While he was doing EMS, he did the reserves for Berkeley County Sheriff's Office. Um, he did the Marine Patrol dive team. He, he did it all. One of his passions was flight. While he was doing all of that, he was also part of the Low Country Flying Club. He flew airplanes. He took up almost all of our family members up in the airplane, showed us all over the place. He worked as a TSA agent at Charleston International. On Monday, as he was driving home, he stopped in traffic due to an accident up ahead. Somebody behind him was not paying attention, and they uh, rear-ended him, and he passed from that rear-ending. Paige says she lost more than her dad. Every, everything. That's my, that's my best friend, and he taught me everything. And that's why I'm at where I am now. I wanted to become a police officer just like him. Andrus leaves behind his wife, Debbie, four children, three grandkids, and one grand puppy. Andrus's funeral will take place this weekend at Dial Murray here in Monk's Corner. The viewing happens tomorrow from three until five, and his funeral takes place Sunday at five o'clock. In Monk's Corner, I'm Raymond Owens. Count on two.